Proud faces out there representing their countries. Alan Smith represented England. Brings back memories. Well, it does because you've got your family in the crowd quite often. You know, they're listening to the national anthem while you're standing there. And uh, it's one of those days that you don't tend to forget. Very proud for these players. It's an international fixture here, Alan. That will bring back memories for you and your England career. Well, it is a proud moment. You stand there, you sing along to the national anthem and... Uh, you just want to do yourself justice representing your country. This is the team picked by Australia for this game. And it's interesting, they've got three at the back and three up front. It's quite an unusual formation, isn't it? You don't often see it. It's going to be interesting to see how it pans out here. But uh, I think the manager has got an option to switch, maybe go back to uh, four at the back if he wants to. Enjoy the now we can check on the lineup. Two banks of four, 4-4-2. Four, four, yeah, how it always used to be. Don't see it quite so often these days, but uh, that's a classic formation and uh, really capable of causing problems here today. A lot of build-up. Finally, we're underway for the game itself. And that's uh, across the field to try and switch the play. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Coming on strong and looking to play their way through now. And he shoots from long range. Well, from that distance, that was pretty close. Yeah, it looked like the keeper was worried for a second there. I like the look of this attack. Bit of space to go forward into with the ball. They've opened them up here. Goalkeeper has to go and uh, get the ball for the goal kick. What about that chance a few minutes ago? We can see it again now. Well, only he will know whether he was going for goal there. In the end, he nearly scored. Throw easy. Australia carrying the ball forward well. Behic. Good defending. That's a fine challenge, and he's got the ball. Well, the tackle there has led to a throw. Behic. Easy. Trying to slip it through. It's looking good this move. Sing. And they've cut it out. He's good at cutting those passes out in that 
middle of the park. And now the shot! And the goalkeeper has done well to stop that one. That's a corner. Quick-witted and quick in his movement too to intercept there. And the Socceroos striving to attack now. Just under the crossbar. Yeah, I think he thought for a moment there it was going to actually hit the bar, but no, he's got a goal and it's a good one. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Good interception. Good forward play from them. To really get at the opposition here. It's on the move all the time and makes lots of these interceptions. Cruiser. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. This could be it. Time for goal! What a team of fighters. This so-called small club is amazing. Well, that is the beauty of football, isn't it? You can never discount anybody. So a real captain's contribution here with a fine goal. Was a good goal, and it came at a, a crucial time, I think, for his side. Your captain's input there. It is uh, level. Both sides have scored here now. Crassi. Getting forward well as a team now. I think the cross is on. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Guiding it through. And finishing off. It's a sensational goal for the underdogs. Go again, 2 1. Okay, Hill. Played down the wing, keeping the wide attack going. Behic. In the midfield, they've got it back via an interception. Robbie Cruz. 
Well, they're in a good position here. And that's uh, across the field to try and switch the play. Slipping it through. The score! One in front, they would be a lot more comfortable if they were two in front. And they really could have been. Yeah, might they look back on that with a bit of regret because that was a great chance to extend the lead, wasn't it? He made that look like a poor pass with a very good interception. On the attack here. On the move and able to cut out the pass. It's a good place to win the ball here. Referee doing everything possible to keep this game flowing. That will help ease the pressure. Cut out the pass. Comes in with a tackle. That'll be a throw in to Australia. Robbie Cruz. A good control under pressure. Singh. That's good movement forward here. Oh, he's through. Very good distance to the clearance. Troasi. Juric. Really trying to win possession here. Taking on the defenders. Well, this attack threads it through. Shot on. Should be. Well, that could be the insurance goal here. That little bit of daylight that they were after. Deluxe class. Oh, the keeper's pulled off a, a really good save, but that's when he needs the help of his defenders. Three one the scoreline as we restart the game. Sainsbury. And the time Sainsbury. to be added on here is a minimum of three minutes. Three minutes. Oh, they gave it straight to him, didn't they? There's some potential in this move. In quickly. Cahill. That's uh, half time now, and the score is 3 1. Not often, Alan, do you see one man have one half like he's had. On top of his game out there, and I'm sure he'll be thinking about grabbing his hat trick in the second half. Second half to come now, and Australia get the ball rolling. Robbie Cruiser. Pressed and won the ball well forward. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Throw for Australia. 
Milligan. Into the attacking third. Cleared away, well away from goal. Now this is an interesting attack. Behic. Nice interplay between the two of them. It's on the move all the time and makes lots of these interceptions. And there is some backup for him in this position. Clever thought with the pass, but the execution was not good. Good position, they've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. Well, there's still time if they can get this goal. It's a tactical substitution for the losing team here. Put the corner in the middle. Defended well. Cruiser. The goalkeeper will get this one, no problem. That's good movement forward here. Probing the pass. Space for the shot. And he's got it up and over the goalkeeper and he scored. Goalkeeper came off his line, really challenging the attacker to do that, but he's done it. That is one of the hardest skills out on the pitch, to be able to get the, the weight of chip just perfect. We expected this, such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. Sainsbury. Throw easy. Really getting at the opposition this far up the pitch now. Good reading of the play, anticipating the pass. He's onside and in behind. Comes in strongly. Yedina. A real opening for him. Now oh, the goalkeeper makes the save. Sing. Praise for trying the shot, Alan. Well, his teammates aren't too happy. Well, this guy looks like he's the one the opposition having the most problems with. Well, the defence knew all about him beforehand, but... They really haven't got tight enough, and as a result, he's been working the keeper, and he's got on the score sheet, hasn't he, a few times. Spotted well by the defender, cut it out. I don't know whether they'll be able to keep this up. They've still got the lead. Well, they've come out with that fierce determination that underdogs do have quite often. Determined not to roll over and be beaten, but still some work to do. Now the shot! The keeper can deal with that. Here's an opportunity, maybe. And shoots! The shot gets blocked. And it's a straightforward save. Yeah, that was picking cherries. He saved that 100 times out of 100. Shots on here. Oh, nowhere near. No, he's miscued that one. Miscued it badly. We should thank these supporters, Alan, for the atmosphere they've created for us to work with today. And their reward for that is seeing their team win. Yeah, and uh, quite rightly, they're celebrating that here. They can afford to relax. Shots on! Well, they've all gone to the defender to say, well done. 
then I think the guy who had the chance really should have scored. Well, he had the chance to uh, get his shot away, even though he had to take it quickly. He should have done better. Guiding it through. Played in the clear. Here's a chance. What a good way to score. It always looks fantastic when the ball goes into that top corner. And look at it again. Well, scoring in any game is worthy of celebration. When you get two, it is special. And he is feeling that special delight at the moment. Plenty of goals for the fans here. 4-2. Off we go again. They could pose some danger now. And a corner given by the referee. Swung in from the corner. Good defensive clearance there. On to the attack now. A promising build up until that challenge. Behic. Krasi. It's good play until they got that challenge in. Good forward play from them. Looking for teammates in the middle. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. He saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Goal kick to come. Ref's gone back to deal with that earlier incident. Yellow card. He's one of my favourite refs. He doesn't miss much, this lad. Now he's got the ball. What's he going to do with it? Getting forward now into attack Australia. He's got his shot off now. Real miscue here. And let's see what the ref's going to do. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. Now this looks promising. That's great defending there, stopping that attack. Probing with the pass. Behic. He's coming forward with some danger. The fourth official has indicated there will be a minimum of three minutes of each time. Good defending. Cleared it well. He's on the move all the time and makes lots of these interceptions. Can he deal with it here? Referee says free kick. And the referee blows for one last time. The side we expected to win. Cahill.